What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Tough Pro Fan here, aka Vintage Pashis. That's my Instagram handle if anybody cares. I'm also on Twitter at capital T U F Pro Fan. How's everybody doing? Well, as you know by now, if I'm going to do the Raiders Roundup, <laughs> oh, I'm not going to steal the whip noise from other YouTubers, but it just felt right since I called this the Raiders Roundup. But, um, yeah, if I come to you on a Tuesday, it <laughs> means the Raiders lost. Oh, I'm so sad. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> but, yeah. Raiders lost to the Vikings. For some reason, I really thought they'd win. And then I remembered, hey, Adrian Peterson, am I right? So, uh, yeah, Adrian Peterson ran all over us, which we should have kind of known. He ran 26 times for 203 yards and that nasty old touchdown at the end of the game. Uh, neither quarterback... Well, I mean, Carr performed pretty well. Let's see, 29 of 43 attempts, 3 iron, 2 yards, 2 touchdowns, but the 2 picks. The 2 picks, man. Those 2 picks are just killers. We lost 30 to 14. Like I said, there was the rushing touchdown by Adrian Pearson at the very end of the game. That was just the... <clears throat> that was the dagger. That was the dagger going into my heart. And every Raiders fan heart. Um, we got stabbed once when Derek Carr threw that pick. And we got stabbed again when Adrian Pearson just said, Screw it, I'm scoring again. Even though we're winning. And yeah, we lost 30-14. to 14. Uh, I'm not giving up hope. We're 4-5. and five. Unfortunately, we're tied with the Chiefs now. And... The Broncos are kind of dropping now. Peyton Manning's not going to start. They're starting Brock Oswalter, or however you say his name. So, um, we still got kind of a chance. We still got a chance. We're still going up a little bit. We have to beat the Lions. This is very important now. We have to beat the Lions. Uh, they got some momentum after beating Green Bay like that. So, um, this game is important. We can get back up to 500 by beating a really bad team. But we just have to take away all their momentum. They don't really have a running game, which is good. Um, we got to keep the ball out of the hands of the Stafford-Johnson connection. And we'll be alright if we can do those two things. Um, and we got to make sure that David Carr, as much as really good as he is, he doesn't have to throw the big bomb late in the game. I know he's trying to win the game for us, but we have Latavius Murray. We have Marcel Reese. We have some running game. You got to get a little closer. You got to throw a few slant passes, short passes, quick passes. You don't have to throw the big bomb when you're losing. Am I right, people? Right? You know I'm right. You know I'm right. Derek Carr with these late game picks, bombs, thrown for picks, is getting a little repetitive. And we need to stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Alright, so like I said, we lost 30-14. to 14. Next week, we're facing the Lions. Uh, just go over a few stats for you. Like I said, Adrian Peterson. I gotta give the bad guys. <laughs> I gotta give the opponents their due every once in a while, even though I'm not happy they won. Uh, Teddy Bridgewater played the full game, so there's that. Threw for 140 yards, 14 of 22 attempts, a touchdown. Adrian Pearson, like I said, rushed for 26 for 203 yards and that touchdown. Uh, receiving Stephen Biggs. Diggs, excuse me. Stephen Diggs. Got thrown to twice for 46 yards. I mean, he passed the ball around to a lot of people. There was no standout. There's no dis standout wide receiver, I should say. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me check. Raiders stats real quick. As I said, David Carr. 
threw 29 of 43, 302 yards again with the two interceptions and the two touchdowns. Latavius Murray played, which I'm happy about, but he only rushed 12 times for 48 yards. Um, we didn't use Marcel Reese at all. I don't know if he's injured, but we need to use Marcel Reese more, I think. Uh, yeah, Marcel Reese caught one pass for no yards. We gotta use Marcel Reese more. <coughs> Sorry, I'm gonna learn how to use my tongue and my mouth and speak clearly. Uh, Amari Cooper, AC, got thrown to five times for 79 yards. Michael Crabtree got thrown to four times for 55 yards. Michael Riviera, <laughs> six times for 46 yards. Both teams passed the ball around, like, evenly. Um, like I said, I watched the game, and it just didn't seem like that much was happening. But it almost seemed like not that much was happening throughout the NFL last Sunday, like, no big production by any team. I'm going to go back and check and see who got, you know, the big numbers of the week, but probably Eli Manning or something. But uh, this was a very, you know, besides Adrian Peterson, that was it. So, I'll leave this video here. We lost 3-14. to 14. I'm coming back at you next week. We're facing the Lions, who are two and seven so there's hopefully a chance versus the Lions it's just David Carr's gotta stop with that long bomb towards the end of the game that keeps ending up in a pick he has to stop that um unfortunately I just saw in the news that Eldon Smith is being suspended so we'll see if that affects us at all and yeah that's about it guys I'll see you next, either Monday or Tuesday, with the Raiders Roundup, talking more about the Raiders game. Thank you for joining me. I am Tough Pro Fan. Check out some of my other videos if you want. I do lyric videos on my favorite kind of music. I do fast food reviews, although I haven't done one in a little while. And I'll do all sorts of stuff. Alright, so thanks for joining me again. Thank you very much for watching. I know the... Lighting is weird. I gotta fix that. But, um, yeah. I'll see you guys later, alright? Thank you. Bye.